Yes, I did. I went in just, just it, it will, it will look like I've, I'm a little bit practiced. I did, I did play it a little bit. All right. And so, just to clarify for the viewers, when you say you practiced, you got his health low, and then you just let him just yes. kill you. Yeah, because the one thing about this game is what I learned the hard way is that you can't. Excellent job. Yeah, I can already tell you when you have been practicing. My one thing is that I, I'm... I gotta say, Dad, the way you're taking this fight right now is very similar to how I'd be positioning. Except that part. That would... That was really... That was a really close call. And I gotta say that I'm really impressed with how much better you're fighting this dude now. And I only I only played it for about 20 minutes today. And I got my ass kicked a couple times and I just got used to what his movements are and what they meant. Not that I'm gonna just like kick his ass right here, because I'll still be fight. Like here, like there, but it's and also Alright, excellent. That's like a frame-perfect dodge. It's when it looks like it should have hit you, but it doesn't. You know you've, you've done something correct. Or the hitbox system is just absolutely wrecked. And the hitboxes in this game does get a bit uh, longer at times. I gotta say, Dad, you're getting ballsy in the good way. Ah. Except, yeah, yeah, you got a bit. The camera worked against you there. All right, good job. Didn't even have to remind you to do a health check. Yep. Yep. He's still technically attacking while the animation is occurring. Just to keep in mind for future encounters. Yep, don't get greedy. Really important to not get greedy when you get down to the sliver of health. All right, excellent maneuver. Well How about done. That? Oh god, I'm, I'm too, totally out of the out of the frame, so you probably didn't see me, but that's fine. I was more focused on me. the fight, anyways. No, no, I was talking about people, but they're they're probably not watching me anyway. So, um, pick up the item. He does drop a really nifty crafting material, the Titanite slab, which yeah. we're never going to use, but it's nice to have <laughs> just in case. Okay, Hi. so I just want to say for the record. Your coaching was really good. What what and then once once I got once I got on and I got in there and I just got a chance to yep. so I, and it's helping me because now I'm starting to get an idea of I'm getting more comfortable with taking hits. I'm getting much more comfortable being yep. right on top of the boss. Yeah. Because I'm I'm a I'm out of the if I touch it I die. So I've got that and I'm not button matching. You're working as much. against your established muscle memory from the old school way of gaming. Right. Understandable. Right. The one thing that I did find I'm doing a lot, especially in that particular fight, is mm -hmm. when I go to when I go to just B, I'm rolling instead of instead of sprinting. So and is that because I'm 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 releasing it? It's because you're just tapping the B button. Okay, so it's, it's so it's like a nervous thing. It's 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 kind of like a because I if I you mean let go to, of the B so button it's like, almost bit. like I'm double hitting it when I mean to when I mean to sprint. I'm double hitting it almost. Yeah. Yeah, you might be double hitting the okay. B button. All right. Well, I didn't mean to spend a bunch of time uh, talking, so we can we can. Keep All right, going the ladder. Yep, go forward. Go forward. There should. There's a ladder somewhere. Okay. Oh, it's over there. Yep. To the right. To the right. To the right. Yep. Where that torch is. Okay. All right, Dad. Now, before you enter the hallway, because we do need to pick up a couple of items, we're gonna be kind of going back through the prison again because we got some new enemies that spawned in. Black Knights All right. that weren't here before are now here on your return visit. So you see that hole sort of on the right of the screen? Uh, the right of the just, screen. Yeah. Yeah, just, yeah, go for, yeah, just go to the right while right. on the platform. Go through that, like, opening Where the, into that hallway. Yes, that opening right there. Through the, yep. through the bars? Yeah, through the bars. Okay. Go through the bars and then turn left. There's a Black Knight. Go ahead and defeat the Black Knight. He, I believe, drops a crafting material for the next Zweihander upgrade. 
which is not going to be for much later on. Ooh. Well, wait a minute. Where? I, I, where's his? Dad, dad, dad. I, Ooh. Ooh. I don't know. What you. the hell was going on? He had you. Okay, so sometimes the game does this weird glitch. Oh, yeah, because you were pinned in between two pillars on the wall, and he was standing right in front of you, so you couldn't maneuver out of there. Right, dad, dad, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. We got to get back your 20,000 souls, and we still got to pick up those items. So go through that doorway. Stop. Now go down that ladder. You're essentially going back to where you literally started. Is there anything down there? Y yeah. No, like nothing thinking. that's going to attack you just yet. We're, we're going back to the Black Knight that just defeated you. Yep, go through that doorway. Yep, yep, no, you, you don't have to be so skittish here. You okay. can just... Yep. Go ahead and pick up your souls, and let's try the fight again. Oh, okay. I, I thought we were doing something clever. I just... All right. No, we're not doing anything clever. We're just... Oh, oh shit. Ooh, yeah, you mistimed that. Wow! You mistimed it again. <laughs> Did back I up really? and heal. Dad, just... just yep. Yeah. Dad, back... Really back up and heal. Wait for him to do an attack while out of safe range, and then heal. Because he's just gonna keep doing that shit to you. It's like a human player. Just spam the, the cheap I win move. And you're even getting more balls to even taking red well, red titanite. He was pissing me off. Red titanite chunks. Press A to you gotta just a little uh, 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 yeah, okay. Yeah, just, sorry. You keep forgetting to do it and it kinda drives me crazy sometimes. What am I supposed no, to do here? Oh just yeah, just press press A or B. You, you, you hit the message thing on accident. Okay. All right, go forward. You're going to go back to the dungeon cell you started the game in, and there's a new item in there. We are going to need this for access to another area. The Peculiar Doll. Cool. Uh, don't, worry, don't worry about it now. It will come into play later on. Go forward now. Yep, keep going this way. We're going to go back the way we came. Back okay. to that bonfire you were just at. And that red titanite chunk you picked up is crafting material for the next Zweihander upgrade down the line. That's also why we wanted to get that item. Also, just in case you're wondering, I've got you on a different monitor, so I'm actually kind of looking at you on screen versus okay. looking the off. Yeah, just go, Dad. You can I just go. Was... Oh, no, Dad, Dad, turn around. No, 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 no. You were going that, that doorway right there. Yes. And go up the ladder, please. You ever watch a character's model just shake your ass as they climb up the ladder? Uh, uh, maybe, maybe Tomb Raider, but not this. <laughs> right. You... Where, what am I just, just, just rest, rest at the bonfire, Dad. Okay. All right, now let's go out, go to level up and same deal: vitality, endurance. Yep, perfect. Nope, that, you're good. Just press A. And confirm reinforcement. Alright, now pan your camera to the right. The doorway in the corner. Which corner? Yeah, the, the corner to the left. This right here? Nope, 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 nope. I said corner. I didn't say 180 degrees behind you. This corner. Oh, is it really? Try opening it. Why is it closed? Oh, I guess because it got reset when you do the return visit. All right, uh, go back towards the boss room, but we're going to go through that doorway down through on the left. So that door that you can kind of, that, that you went to, like, when you first went into this room at the start. Yeah, so yeah, just go around these pods, and then it's the door to your left. Just roll through them, roll through them. You can just roll through them. There you go. When in doubt, roll through it. Yep, go down this way. There's another Black Knight we're gonna fight, who I believe also drops a Red Titanite chunk. In here? Yes, he's gonna be down down at the end of the hallway. Far to the left. This looks familiar. 
Oh, no, 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 yeah. Yeah, you've been through here before at the very start of the game. Go for it now. Follow up with another right. Yep. Perfect. That's exactly how I would have maneuvered there. You really are. You're, you're picking this up. All right. Yep. Another red Titanite chunk. Now, go forward, please. I haven't had, I haven't had sex like once or at once, I guess, when I, a couple times when I was. This. Go th yep, through the here? doorway and up and up the stairs. Go through this doorway. Now, the guy who gave you the Estes flask at the start of the game, right. he's going to confront you here. You'll have to fight him. Yeah, so he's in that cell, so just, yep, go go forward. Yep, down that hallway. Just just go forward down the hallway. It's okay. Okay, there he is. Lock on and fight him. Ah, oh, he's fat rolling. He's fat rolling. What's that mean? Yeah, I, watch, watch the way he rolls. Oh. Okay, you did... You can probably see it in the footage earlier, but did you see how he was kind of slamming on the ground and rolling very slowly? Yeah. Yeah, that's fat rolling. That's what happens when you have too much heavy gear on your character oh, okay. and not enough like endurance. Okay, so that's or not a good load. thing. It's not like a like a yeah. No, like it's a skill. it's it's sluggish. It leaves you wide open for a longer period of time for attacks of opportunity by enemies you're actively fighting. So if I come at somebody and he fat rolls, then I, th if I don't if I don't attack him, if he fat rolls, I can just turn around and just bash the shit out of him. So you could, yeah. Okay. So what do I what am I doing here, buddy? Uh, yep. Yeah, go right. Yep. Go down there. Go up the stairs to the left. I don't think the boulder's gonna roll down again. Yes, it will. Go off the stairs. Once again, I forgot they reset the area. That includes all unlocked doors, traps. All right, right so up the, am I still up the going stairs. up here? Yep, go up the stairs. You're fine. God, this, this, this camera wobbling like that. Oh, okay. Oh, these fuckers. Okay. Yeah, just more of those dudes. Just take them out. Yeah, well, no, have them. Lock onto them, idiot. You know, I've got a theory. Um, Whoa! Okay, okay. This is actually kind of cool. Uh, back up, back up. Robin, am I supposed to get it or not? Oh, never mind. Yeah, it's fine. I, I was so taken aback because I almost never see these. Okay. These little pick, go ahead and pick up pillage body. All right, so kind of get your cam character out of the way. I want to look at this. Okay, so this is ugh, what they're called. I forget exactly what they're called. I encountered them in my solo playthrough on my YouTube channel. They're like these little like crab dudes that will spawn, and it depends on. It's based on how many real players die in a specific area. Like the more real life players that die in one particular area increases the chances of these crab dudes spawning right and they have like this pin missile attack where they shoot like a bunch of like little spikes at you that can potentially one shot you just a little weird yeah no 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 nope go through that door to the right uh check your health you got two shield guys coming up and they occasionally will spawn those little crab dudes yeah go ahead and fight them and we're gonna go through that door once you're done taking them out I, I, you have a giant sword. They're they're trash mobs. You can sneeze on them, even when they're fully like on guard. Now press A to open the door. So before you couldn't open the door, but that key you picked up on the rooftop back in Firelink Shrine is the key to this door cell. Now now go down. There's gonna be an item you can pick up, okay. but the stairs are kind of like yep. Yeah, pick that item. Rusted iron ring. Now you can drop down the stairs, and now we are good to leave the asylum. Okay. And we're going to go to the next area, and oh boy, are you in for a treat. Which way am I going, buddy? Just All right, uh, yep, go down the stair, down the stairs, not up the stairs, but down the stairs. And then open that door, it's the shortcut that we didn't have access to before. 
and I'll go through the door and oh, oh. up these yeah up the stairs oh, okay here we are do I want to do I want to get some my I can reset my S's yeah here, yes? you can yeah you can if you want it's just you're not really gonna be going on a dangerous adventure you just said oh boy oh boy oh boy it's like I'm gonna be screwed well, not until... Well, you'll get to another bonfire before we get to the oh boy, oh boy adventure part. You'll be resting at a couple of bonfires on our journey. Oh, we're going to talk to Keen Seeker Frampt, and we're going to sell some stuff. Oh, Sock Guy! You're going to talk to Sock Guy, finally. All right, so what am I doing here? Exit through the door, not that doorway. We are exiting, exiting the asylum now. We came here to beat a boss, pick up a couple oh, of shit. crafting materials, and we need the peculiar doll to access one area. Excellent job. Use the proper attack for the space that you're in. Narrow spaces, you wanna you wanna right trigger. Wide open spaces, you wanna right bumper. All right, now uh, go up the stairs. Dad, turn around. Just go up. No, go up that. Yeah, just, I meant up the path. Up the path. Yeah, keep going forward up the path. Oh, okay. All right. And go back to the crow and just have the crow... Or go back to the, the crow's nest and rest at the nest. Or press A when you get the prompt. And then you'll be one with the birds. I am curling up like a ball. Yes. Which is something I'm very good at. I'll we tell you something. The from some of the stuff that I've that I've seen, it's just it's just it's just it's just such a treat to play something that somebody gave a shit. It's like watching a movie that somebody gave a shit when they made it. The people, all the people, and it takes a lot a lot of people to do anything like this or a movie. Something like this is actually more I would assume is more complicated than a movie. Yeah, it's well, yeah. Game design is give, always. You have to tell, dad, 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 don't curl oh, up like a ball again. Shit, I, what press, do I press, do? Skip, skip the cutscene. Press start. Skip the cutscene. Just. I, I, it's not. Or select. Just press the buttons until you skip something. I think it's okay, the select button. This... Curl up like a ball again. Let's go back to the Firelink Shrine. Don't hit the A button I'm sorry. until after. I, I'm sorry. Okay. All right. All right. I'm getting impatient. I'm sorry. 